Hey everybody, I'm Rob Zip, and today I am in San Antonio, Texas. I'm actually right next to the Alamo, and we're gonna go to the San Antonio Fire Museum, me and my parents. So come along and join us on this episode of The Most Epic Adventures. San Antonio. There, I guess the jurisdictions of the uh, fire department here. Got these old water wagons, I guess. Go in the back, there are all kinds of goodies. Yeah, okay, well, there you go. That's dad, dad making his appearance. Very cool. It's a, so this is the old uh, the old firehouse here in downtown San Antonio. Now it's a museum with all these old old trucks. I mean, why why get rid of them? Why throw them out? You can just enjoy them forever. The old uniforms. Look at this old engine from 1892. Holy smoly. This is kind of strange. Uh, for a time they made these fire trucks these greenish yellow color. I think they thought they'd be more recognizable. You know, easier to see, but I think people just, people just prefer red, red fire trucks. Oh my goodness. <laughs> ladder and trampoline it's a safety trampoline so for people that are having to jump out of windows wow Draft. Very cool. Local San Antonio artists paints firefighter helmets. She's a member of this museum. There is her picture. I guess she's a she. She looks like a, she's an actual firefighter. So she's a firefighter and an artist. There you go. Very cool. Well, let's go to the annex. They got a little bar, <laughs> got a little bar back here. Look at that. It's the EM EMS area. A lot of people don't realize that your local, when you call the ambulance, you're calling the fire department. This old lively fellow up there, ready to put out some fires. little theater telling you the, uh, the history of firefighting in San Antonio. Here's a fun little area for kids. When they come to the museum, they can get pictures as firefighters and get a picture with the, uh, the dog up there. That's a firefighter kitchen. And it looks like they've got a Cushman mini fire truck. I guess you can drive that around during parades and stuff. Toy fire trucks. You can see my reflection here. I'm wearing a Valkyrie t-shirt. They are a San Antonio traditional heavy metal band. Very excellent band. I had to represent my friends while I was here in San Antonio. Support, local, support your local metal bands, guys. Oh, look, some Boy Scout stuff. If you didn't know, I am actually an Eagle Scout, so it's always cool to see stuff like this on display in museums like this. 
take a look in the back of this ambulance here. Oh no, we got a kid. We got a, we got a sick kid in there. No, no. It must be pretty, pretty extreme. The kids in the ambulance by themselves. And then these people are out here. He's like, hey, what's going on? You good, buddy? You good? Yeah, okay, all right, cool. That'll be $5,000, please. Welcome to America. Life and fire, fire station here. The guy's going, he's going down the chute. Just sit there and you sleep. Get as much sleep as you can because you never know when that uh, alarm bell is going to go off and you got to go fight that fire. And then back here by the entrance, you've got patches from around the state, from around the country, right by the bathroom. So if you're really into fire stuff, patch collecting is a big thing. And uh, yeah, we've got a kitchen, kitchen exhibit back here. Look at all these patches, man. Like look at all over the world. It's Toronto, Houston Old Spanish Trail Ambulance, Pasadena Arson Division, and then then he got the old uh, the old fire station kitchen. Uh, you know, if, if you've ever been able to have a fireman cook for you, they are amazing chefs. Because most of the time they're in the uh, they're in the fire station, waiting for an adventure. So, oh, that's the staff only room. Okay, uh, but so yeah, here's a here's a picture. Shrimp boil, 1940. You got a glare, some glare there, but you can see the guy, the hands full of shrimps. He almost looks like Truman, Harry Truman there, but. Yeah, this is the actual, that's the actual sink that's in this picture from 1940. So right here, and the, the stove. So right here, this guy did a shrimp boil 82 years ago in this very place. But yeah, firemen, they sleep, they eat, and they wait to go help out their citizens. So um, really good cooks. If there's a fireman watching this and you want to cook for me, I'll eat it up. <laughs> have a shrimp boil that sounds like fun i know people love the crawfish boils but shrimp peeled shrimp i don't want to have to peel that i don't want to do work man come on let's have a fireman's shrimp boil okay this is a short one but i hope you enjoyed it coming along with me and my parents here and there's my mom um yeah if you're by the alamo and uh you're somewhat interested in in, in fire department stuff this is a cool place they've got uh Cool things. Yeah. Oh, it's five bucks. It's five bucks. Three dollars for seniors. There you go. Three dollars for seniors. How about for kids? Um, what do you I don't notice? know. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, but yeah, I do recommend uh, if you're in San Antonio, check out the San Antonio Fire Museum. So with the that being, people very nice in here. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's okay, Mom. That's okay. The people are very nice in here. <laughs> With that being said, remember to drink water, listen to metal, listen to some Valkyrie. They're my homies. Listen to Valkyrie today. Enjoy nature and have the most epic adventure.